three, two, one. All right, let's get into this intuitive reading, this intuitive message, this guided reading, divinely led message for Adrian Slays. This reading is alleged and for entertainment purposes. Sometimes the tea is hot and sometimes it's not. You have to watch the video to the end to determine for yourself. Okay, so she is dealing with a lot of emotions right now. Spirit is acknowledging um, and she is trying to point blame, poking fun. But I always say when one finger is pointed, several fingers are pointed back. It is emotional. There's an energy of suffering, full disdain, displeasure and reading between the lines or needing to do so in her energy field. Subconsciously, this situation happened because she was trying to add layer on a cake she was trying to um trying to invoke this energy of accomplishment self-esteem confidence fame accolades and talent so this came about because she was trying to be out she was trying to be visible she was trying to gain some kind type of notoriety okay and spirit said you can't do that because you're not grounded spirit is acknowledging where you raised in a barn there's something about her thoughts and her moods and how they move and they swing in the wind air sign energy is coming through spirit is acknowledging that they're not in the house they're outside of the house and they, they don't beg okay so they like to be invited in and so that is on her that is up to her to invite and invite spirit into her life spirit is acknowledging that there's an energy of poor manners lack of tact discourtesy impo impoliteness social grace is required when it comes to adrian slays okay let's get into it spirit what do you want me to share moving in love and light for adrian slays okay all right, we do get details, details, details. It's all in the details, so I don't know if you're getting ready to sign a contract. I don't know what you're getting ready to do. When it comes to paperwork, you better read the fine print, honey, because it is all in the details. The most powerful patterns are created within the tiniest details. Pay attention. There's some type of m m some script, something that's coming up, and she does not have enough information. You need to seek someone to help you figure out what this is all about. Read the fine print. Pay attention to details. Get real close and on that contract before you sign it um, this is a time to be aware of the fine print in all areas of your life look at the details and leave the broad strokes for another time when this card appears in the reading it's a sign to finesse a project make small but meaningful gestures or add a personal touch to your correspondence be aware that what you need to know lies in the details if you're entering into an agreement of any kind pay attention to them before not after when it's too late clarity and transparency are key you can gain great understanding by observing the minute minute excuse me body language offhand remarks and fleeting facial expressions that reveal the larger picture so whoever you're amongst when you're signing that pay attention to the energy pay attention to their face you know pay attention to their eyes the windows to the soul okay all right adrian slays current energy All right, trash. There's something that she's trying to get rid of. There's something that she's trying to throw away. There's something that she's trying to toss out. And this can um, definitely relate to a fire sign. Romantic, passionate, but chaotic. Spirit is acknowledge acknowledging to in the area of trying to get rid of something. She's dealing with depression. Okay, because she knows she fucked up or they know they fucked up. She's venting even about her situation. Spirit said that she needs to pay attention. Be careful because they both look the same. Salt or sugar looks can be deceiving. This person who you were around, this guy knows that they fucked up you kind of know you fucked up too and now you want to vent and talk about your issues with this person and you shouldn't trust this person anyway because spirit said you should have used your intuition your higher level chakras to know that salt and sugar look the same and looks can be deceiving okay spirit is also acknowledging again that you're trying to burn evidence what is this about fire and burning in burning energy burning something these cards fell into my lap spirit is also acknowledging that she can be a great actress so pay attention because sometimes she is putting on a show she's insecure in the area of love she feels like because she got kicked to the curb and this broke the contract, be that marriage or relationship or some type of intense, like long term relationship. But it broke the, it broke the contract uh, because this wasn't it wasn't meant for you. You were not on your righteous path and you have a lot of insecurity around the area of passion. Spirit said that there's betrayal in her energy and that she needs to check herself in regards to that. She does feel backstabbed. Spirit is acknowledging, but that's not my business. This reading is alleged and for entertainment purposes. OK, and somebody was trying to keep a promise, but now they put the information out there. OK, 
trying to keep a promise, trying to stand tall with something and someone. Um, but that energy in this relationship was outdated. It was expired, disused, and you need to let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Spirit is also acknowledging that she's under a spiritual attack and she's fighting off negative energy and fighting a spiritual warfare and needing to clear her energy, clear, cancel, and release. I say to the ancestors, I say to the universe. And this has to do with her fulfilling a fantasy. I don't know what she was into, but this negative energy, this karma that's coming back to her has to deal with her wanting to fulfill these fantasies okay and the thing about karma is karma is going to catch up with you eventually the energy that you put out into the universe will align with you because it is what yours all right not my business huh. adrian slays moving in love and light current energy okay spirit is acknowledging the bag okay so she is trying to get a bag she's trying to keep a bag she okay be careful what you do for money all right, values, discipline, gain, income, resources, money, management, placeholder, support, gains, benefit, power, savings, earnings, abundance, profession, work, career, paths, finances are a factor. So something about how she gets the bag, how she's trying to maintain the bag, hold on to the bag. Spirit said to look at this picture more intensely as well. I don't know if she's changed her hair recently or done something, but Spirit is also acknowledging this tattoo is very important for me to see and to know. Did she get a new tattoo? Does she have tattoos? There's something about this that makes it like a timestamp kind of moment. And then how she's getting the bag. Spirit said focus on self-worth, okay? What are you doing to get this bag? Not my business. All right. When it comes to relationship energy, what's going on with Adrian Slaves? Okay. <laughs> um, guilty is charged, so that's it. Like the person is guilty. Whatever it is that you're thinking of, I knew that card was gonna come out because I kept feeling it while I was talking to y'all, and I was like, eh, I'm gonna just let energy do what energy does, okay? But someone is guilty. Their um, your intuition has been warning you about this particular person. They are guilty as charged. Someone feels guilty for something that they did or said. Accusations being accused of wrongful things. But this is interesting because there's a friend request. Now this person could be reaching out to you, or you could be reaching out to this person, um, an old friend or an ex-lover wants to make amends. So be careful because they already guilty as charged. But the reason why this energy is there is because somebody is playing the brouhaha. Somebody is playing mind games. And it doesn't, I mean, this is layered, okay? It, it, it does feel like you play with the brouhaha because the card came up. But Spirit is also acknowledging that someone um, is putting manifestations, intentions um, on your energy. And that's unfortunate. And so some of this is just you getting some kind of energy from someone else. Like someone else's intentions to to create an uneasy situation for you. Does that make sense? So there's ill intentions and someone just heavily plotting against you and your relationship. Uh, spell work may be involved. Yeah. Sending you love and light. All right. So let's get into this tarot deck. Adrian Slays moving in love and light. Thank you. All right, so there is an energy of the Four of Wands, passionate and um, and chaotic and romantic kind of energy, um, acknowledging on the surface that she's home. I don't know what that means. Um, the Sisphere says, I'm home, and she's happy here. She's happy there. Uh, subconsciously with the Page of Pentacles, she's back there because there's been financial ruin, loneliness, and loss, um, sending her love and light. In the middle of the deck, Spirit is acknowledging with the Empress in reverse. She's very closed off. Solar plexus is closed off. Heart chakra is closed off. She's dealing with a lot of creative blocks. And this could be because somebody's intentions are to create some ill will for her that's out there. Um, and she has a lot of dependence on others. What is the current energy in regards to Adrian Slays and her mother? So the person that requested this said that there's something going on with Adrian Slays and her mother. Okay. Right. Spirit is acknowledging that when it comes to her mother, there is an energy of wishes being fulfilled. Someone is being completely satisfied and happy with where they are right now. Like, you know what? I, I'm cool. But you see how the solar plexus energy is crossed? So there's something that you can't do. There's something that you have no power to do. So you're like, I'm good. I'm just wish you well wish you well kind of energy so it is also acknowledging that this is very emotional 
um, and that someone wants to offer a sense of like forgiveness or uh, extend the olive branch. Thank you, spirit, um, because it's a lot of overwhelming energy, overwhelming emotion. Spirit is also acknowledging when it comes to these two that there are a lot of options um, and there are manifestations to figure out which way to go. If that makes sense, spirit is also acknowledging with the five of pentacles in reverse Taurus energy on this Scorpio energy was on this card. There is going to be a recovery from financial loss when it comes to them feeling like the foundation could be bridged, could be mended, um, and that there is spiritual poverty when it comes to them. And again, that goes back to that first card. Spirit is not going to beg. Spirit wants to be invited in. And so if you want spirit to help in, in, in this relationship as well, you call out to the highest vibrating source and you request that. But your intentions have to be pure, okay? Because this 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 realm don't speak English, Portuguese, Spanish, Swahili, blah, blah, blah. This inner this realm speaks energy it speaks frequency and so your frequencies have to be aligned all right spirit is also acknowledging with the four of swords in reverse libra energy these two together combined feel very burnt out with a lack of progress in regards to their relationship something else is in the middle of the deck all right spirit is acknowledging with this aquarius and pisces energy the king of cups there is an energy of emotional balance con con and control and generosity. It feels like there's going to be a, a, a male energy that's going to come through and kind of help bring balance. Or a very masculine type of energy is going to come and try to bring balance to the situation. All right, what's next for Adrian Slaves? All right, Virgo energy, Libra energy. She's a quick thinker. She's like trying to be 10 steps ahead of the next one. Organized and perceptive and independent. That's what's next. She's thinking. She's also thinking and considering about moving, Spirit says. Um, again, over the water, moving near water, moving by water. Um, I don't know where she is. In the Aries energy, this could also affect love. So being tempted to move again, Spirit says, again, for love. This is emotional for her with the three of wands in the area of business, but also in the area of passion. It is chaotic. Um, so she's trying to prepare and kind of think about enterprise and, and expansion and see what that might involve, okay? Thank you, Spirit. Spirit is also acknowledging with the Page of Cups, it's not going to it's not going to be fulfilling because there's going to be obstacles and delays. Again, there's someone's intentions to just create ill will and, and harm. So clear, cancel, and release, honestly, um, because it feels like there's an energy of her being trapped and manipulated. Thank you, Spirit. With the Page of Cups, emotional immaturity and a lot of creative blocks is in her energy field, regardless of where she moves. But like we always say, wherever you go, that's where you are, okay? So you got to deal with your shit because you got, wherever you go, honey, that's where you are. You're going to take your bags with you the next place and the next place and the next place because it feels like she's a bag lady, okay? All right, moving forward, this reading is alleged and for entertainment purposes. Now we sit back and let the universe do what the universe does.